This isn't like Top Chef. I'm not going to run around. I'm not going to jump over the island. Okay? <laughs> this is going to be the chillest cooking competition with no contestants ever. <laughs> I'm so well, we're in my kitchen, and today we're gonna to try out a new thing where I have a mystery ingredient and then one hour to make a dinner and dessert for me and Ham. This is episode one, scene one. Yeah. <laughs> what a crisp, cleanly folded paper bag. There's a package inside this package. Oh, <laughs> okay. Oreos. So I have to make dinner and dessert using Oreos in one hour. Oh yeah. I have to just be really smart in what I decide to do so that I can get it done in an hour. That's gonna be the big thing. Uh, so the show doesn't have a name yet, but we're calling it Club Sola because I have lights that change colors. <laughs> do you wanna do it? Should I turn it on? I think you have to. Yeah. Huh? Club Sola? Oh, maybe we should keep the first episode unnamed and then the people can name it. I think maybe we could grill something. I want to crust some meat with the cookie part. What about Korean barbecue? There's this place that I used to go to all the time before the pandemic called Kangdo Bakjung. I might be saying it wrong. And they have a special short rib. So maybe we can do something like that. And then for our dessert, hold on, let me ask him. <laughs> Can I consult you? Mm -hmm. So the ingredient is Oreos. Ingredients Oreos. <laughs> so we have Oreos. Okay, so I'm gonna do Korean barbecue. Ooh. Should I draw a picture? That's my basket of lettuce. It's my little bowl of samjang. Special short rib. Score marinade. Grill. Toss in cookie marinade. That sounds good. That's kimchi. We're gonna get banchan. Make some corn cheese. Can you? incorporate the cream in the corn cheese? Yes. Yes. I like a little sweetness yes. instead of... Yes. Yes. I'm so into that. Do you know what dessert you're making? No. I want fruit. We have our roasted pineapple. Or what if we coat it in the cream and char it? Mm -hmm. So it like maybe brulees. We did it. We're ready to go. Wait, do you think I can make it all of this in an hour? I've got my menu, I've got my shopping list, and now I'm ready to hit the road. This is like one of our favorite meals because we just go to H Mart, we get kimchi and banchan and different lettuces and herbs and then we'll have that with our meat. Okay, so I got, I saw some stuff and just went for it. So we got a few extra things. We're adding potato salad. So I ditched the pineapple from mango. Cucumber. I think it'd be nice to do a little smashed cucumber salad. I love cucumber salad. So this looks like a lot of stuff, but it's actually it's actually pretty simple because a lot of this stuff is prepared and all I have to do is put it in a container. Yeah, I'm ready. Three, two, one, go. Okay, cool. <laughs> I'm going to start by butterflying the beef so I can get it dry brined. I wanted something thicker, but we're going to make this work because this is what we found. Unravel it. Okay, I'm just trying something out. I've never cut meat like this before. Has all of my time elapsed already? If I had more time, I would let this dry brine right overnight. Okay, meat, done. Okay, so I'm gonna cook my potatoes. So we're gonna peel it and cut it into cubes and then cook it. Multitasking. Mm -hmm. Water filling up while I peel. Going for like rough one inch pieces. We're just gonna chop and drop. Okay, lots of salt. Now, the rice. Okay. Swish, swish, swish. This was one of my first jobs with my mom. You just wanna go until you can see your hand through the water. It's never gonna get totally clear. Okay, let's go light some coals. Where are the scissors? Hey, Ham, do you know where the scissors are? That's not where they normally are. <laughs> man, sabotage, man, sabotage. Also not a grilling expert, so if I'm doing this wrong, I'm sorry. I made a mistake, okay, so, oh no! I have a plan. 
We're gonna let that do its thing. Return to the kitchen. The whole point is the Oreos. So easy to forget. <sighs> let me make my smashed cucumber salad, actually. You can kind of do anything with a cucumber salad. Not sure what we're doing exactly, but it will have Oreos. I have some chili crisp that I made myself. We're gonna break the rules. This isn't gonna be like a traditional Korean. This looks pretty good though, right? It's working, it actually works. I mean, worst case scenario, I have one thing. I'm gonna make my marinade for my meat and that's gonna go on my short rib after the first grill. So the short ribs are gonna get grilled twice and then they're gonna come off. I'm gonna snip it with scissors, toss it in our Oreo marinade and it's gonna hit the grill again. Am I allowed to get help? Wait, maybe Ham can smash. Hey, Ham! Ham! <laughs> Could you smash? Smash. 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 I've decided okay. that you, it's allowed in the rules that you can help. Okay. Yeah? <laughs> there you go. We're gonna make a little Korean style potato salad. So much sabotage, I gotta open bottles. So much to unravel here. It has QP sesame oil. And then I'm gonna go just the cream in here. And I, I love it because the Asian pear and the potato, once they're in the dressing, look exactly the same, so it's like a little surprise which one you're gonna stab. Sesame seeds. This is a lot of potato salad. Potato salad, done. Cucumber salad, done. I need more Oreo cream. Okay, I wanna be outside in 10 minutes. You think that's possible? This is ready for the grill. Mango! Cookies and creme brulee mango! Yeah. Hey, Ham. I'm gonna recruit you again. Ham can wash the lettuce, that seems fair. 23 minutes left? Plenty of time. Cream brulee, I like that. Remember how I said you should cool clean as you go? A couple of cats per, that feels good. What do I got, like 20 minutes? 20 minutes. Let's arrange our banchans. Squid, done. The best banchan. Look at all these dishes I made, huh? Cool. And I guess we're gonna go grill now, right? Gonna grill some corn. And then on this side, we'll hopefully melt our mango. And I guess we can get our short ribs on here. While that does its thing, Oh, the cream just like melted. I was really worried about how that would incorporate, but it totally just melted right in there. I think that's gonna be tasty. Korean food does have like a really good balance of, of sweet and savory and funk. I really truly love Korean food. I'm not an expert, I just, I love it. This is my like favorite thing. I love when they do this table side. Snip the meat into the marinade and then it's gonna get hit on the grill again. Even though we're eating a tough cut, it's gonna be really nice and tender and easy to put in those lettuce wraps. Now we tossy toss in our Oreo sesame chili marinade. Oh yeah, it's gonna caramelize. Yum. A mango brulee. Some of that sugar just fell right off. <laughs> I don't know what I thought was gonna happen. I just wanna kiss it with the flames. Yeah. There's one extra toasty one. I think that looks good. We really did it. 10 minutes over. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Hello. Sir. Hi, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Uh, this what? is my Oreo meal. Short rib with Oreo red chili, ginger garlic marinade, Oreo cookie, smashed cucumber salad, corn cheese with the cream from the Oreos, cookies and cream, mango creme brulee, and the potato salad, sweetened with some of the cream from the Oreo. Samjang didn't happen. I don't know what the hell that is. Potato, potato salad? Potato salad. It's practically uh, a photograph. Yeah, I can't tell which one's which. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I like to double it up. Right. Corn cheese is really good. I'll go for the corn cheese as well. Oreo filling is perfect for corn cheese. Cucumbers are surprising, mm -hmm. right? 
Szechuan-ish. I thought it would just be super sweet. It isn't. It doesn't taste like Oreo at all. No. The cream, it just ended up being like a nice source of sugar and fat. And then the cookie just was like a nice source of bitterness. I really like the Oreo in here. That one's my, I would, I would crave this again. Not just want it again. It you does. You see, it doesn't look, that looks pretty good. Yeah. It's like nice and custardy too when you spoon into the actual mango. That's pretty good. Mm. This is my favorite. I think that we'll probably do the mango and short rib again with the Oreo. Because yeah. I think the Oreo actually did something here. Like it actually made it better. With or without Oreos, this is a really fun meal. We entertain with this meal a lot because it looks super impressive, but how, like half of it is bought. It's all just yeah. real food that you're gonna actually wanna eat. Oh, corn cheese. Man, that stuff is really delicious. If you haven't had it before, you should go make some corn cheese. <laughs>